The FIA World Rallycross Championship for 2023 celebrates its 10th anniversary, making a welcomed return to the venue where it all began in 2014. Montalegre in northern Portugal. And at the first Super Bowl of the season, defending champion Johan Christofferson is in scintillating form, easily taking top spot ahead of Vaby and Hansen. Into the heats, and once again, Christofferson dominates. The most successful World Rallycross driver of all time is in brilliant early season form, winning both of his races in great style. New rules, or old as some say, points are up for grabs by the driver who can top the table after the four heats, adding a sense of urgency to JK's performances on the first day of the season. And in a thrilling heat to Johan Christofferson easily tops the table ahead of Vaby and Gronholm, who was a winner here two times before. But the story of the first two heats on day one of the season is that Johan Christofferson is looking for that sixth world championship title with a passion that we saw last year when the Swedish driver won eight out of ten races. Confirmation that day one and the first day of the season is once again dominated by Johan Christofferson. Baby second, Gronholm third, and a welcomed return after five years away to Sebastian Loeb. It's round two of six in the European Rallycross season. And once again, the defending champion Anton Markland in his Ford Fiesta is showing brilliant pace and form. Some very close battles with the likes of Enzo Ida and the First round winner, Yanis Baumanis, but it is Anton Markland's consistency and skillful driving that has him at the top of the table after three of four heats. Markland seen here in the most exciting of the heats, heat three, in a real tussle with Baumanis, and of course the victory going to Enzo Ida. But it's Anton Markland's consistency across the three heats that has him at the top of the table as he searches for his first win of the season. Enzo Ida is tucked in behind, Baumanis, the winner of the opener of the season, is in third position, O'Donovan four. And to the second round of the Euro RX3, front wheel drive for racing. Damian Litvinovich is the star of the show once again, having won the season opener, the first of his career, in great style in Niriad, Hungary, back in late April. A little bit of bump and barge for Litvinovich, but his consistency across the three heats keep him at the top of the table, and it looks like he'll be locked in a great battle with Nils Valland, seen here winning the third heat of the day. The standings have Litvinovic at the top of the table, Voland in second, Ribeiro in third, Isic Setra is in fourth, but Litvinovic is the man to beat.